What's up Cloud Gamers? Welcome to Cloud Gaming Next Channel. So today I'm going to show you guys how you can use Google Stadia and, and Nvidia Shield TV. This works for the normal Nvidia Shield TV and this works for the Nvidia Shield TV Pro. So to get started, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to download AppToy TV. Now this is not in the Google Play Store, so I'm going to leave the APK for this in the description below. So you guys should be able to download the APK for Aptoid TV in the description below. So once you do so, you're going to open it like this. Then the next step is you want to search for a Chrome browser, right? So just type in Chrome. And uh, just to let you guys know, I'll show you something. So if you type Chrome, you will get Google Br Chrome browser here and you'll get Chrome beta. Now this doesn't work and I'm going to show you guys that this doesn't work but the beta works so you got to make sure that you download and install the beta. I'll show you what happens um, when I just try to use the normal Chrome and you guys can try this for yourself. I also think it's very handy if you have the um, app here right so it makes it easy to navigate so I'm just going to enter this. And so this is what happens when I use the OG Chrome, right? You'll see it takes me to this website pretty much saying that I don't have it. And, you know, people are like, oh, you didn't have in desktop mode. And I'll do that for you guys real quick. Show you guys it is in desktop mode, right? And so let's try that again. So this is what we run into when we try to use the OG Chrome, right? So what you're going to have to do is um just download and let me go back real quick you are going to again want to download the beta so we're going to go here again and we're going to search chrome again i'm using the app to do this it's a lot faster you don't need a bluetooth keyboard or mouse right and then i'll just use the pad to navigate now so scroll down you want to go to Chrome beta you want to install this I already have installed it's gonna say install right here where it says open for me so I'm gonna hit open because again I already have it installed so now check this out make sure guys make sure uh, let me just show you guys this this is very important for this to work um, you have to have it set on desktop mode so come here these three dots do that scroll down and you see I have desktop mode checked off make sure you have that checked off and then the next step you want to do is you want to just go on stadia.google.com and I have it here so you're just going to want to type this in so it brings me to the stadia website right here so as you guys can see this is my google stadia so I can use the, again, I'm using the app. You guys can see here, that's what I'm using. So I can use the trackpad to navigate. And I also have my NVIDIA Shield controller hardwired to the NVIDIA Shield. So I can see my friends list here. I can see what people are playing who are on. Right, it's pretty cool. I can mess around with my settings here, switch account, all that jazz connect controller all that jazz so if i want to play a game all i have to do is just hit play again i'm using the app here and we should be good to go hardwired nvidia shield controller and that is working right now so it's pretty cool guys this is again stadia running on the video show TV and it's pretty snappy it's pretty pretty snappy it's pretty fast so I really really like that but we'll get this started just check out some of the performance give it a minute let it do its thin all right so again using the video shield controller So 
So here we go. And it looks mighty fine, guys. Seriously, no latency issues. Well, it's Assassin's Creed Odyssey running on Google Stadia under Vidi Shield. See if we can get into a battle. Killing goats and all. I'm not going to kill an innocent civilian. But yeah, fellas, this is how you do it. This is how you get Google Stadia running on the Video Shield TV. If you like this video, hit the likes button. Uh, definitely subscribe if you want to see more tutorial videos like this. Let me know in the comments below if you guys appreciate videos like these. And also let me know if you guys have any other recommendations that you will like to see me cover. I fellas appreciate you guys and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Till next time. Peace out.